Hey everyone, and welcome back to To The Moon. I'm Penn, and I will be your host on this adventure. Everybody ready for another day of trauma? Okay, how do we get back in time? Let's see. Through the train. Right, yeah, that would make sense. Ooh. Are we gonna get to see the platypus here? This is some scary looking scarecrows. Some kind of carnival, huh? So we look around? How about I look around and you just stand here? How about we continue speaking in the form of questions for the next hour? Quit blathering and go already. Oh, you ruined it. Scarecrows. Fruits, fresh fruits. Apples, oranges, and tomatoes. We got it all. Wait a minute, tomatoes aren't fruits. Uh, yeah, they are. They are the ovaries of the plant uh, and contain the seeds. That's what a fruit is. But come on, tomatoes? We never, ever refer to them as fruits. We who? I happen to enjoy cooking in groups, okay? Some of us take it very seriously. Uh, the sass. Some hay. Oh, it's the boys. Okay. But I don't want the stupid toy. I want the train. And that's the only train left. Do you want to exchange your prize for a teddy bear instead? No, I just want the train. Now, now, John. Uh, don't make a scene. Joey wanted fair and square, didn't he? But I won too. He just went first. He, it's okay, I'll let you play with it too. See how nice your brother is, Johnny. Okay, you dumplings, don't block the stand now. Come, let's see what's over here. I'm not du a dumpling. You know what? I'm going to call you dumpling from now on. You're bluffing. Okay, uh, let's see. They've got a bunch of things I think they're going to get to play on. Uh, yes, yeah, so the fortunes of wonders are ahead of you. This one might just become a lawyer and this one a doctor. Oh my. Oh, fortune predicting? Oh no. Oh, <laughs> oh that's bad. Come on, uh, I'm getting both of your treats. H hey, where's my tip? Um, so, yeah, uh, that's not good. They're very good at predicting the future. Maybe they just didn't want to say anything bad? Oh, oh. Okay. Where did they go next? I thought they went this way. Did they go down? Welcome and behold the world's smallest ferris wheel. Can we ride it? Absolutely not. Does it even work? Absolutely not. Looks like someone just glued some chairs to a water wheel. Don't know, don't care. Oh, here you go. Hey, it uh, it's whack-a-mole. Whack-a-what? Whack-a-mole? You take a mallet and whack moles? Is that animal abuse? They're fake moles, butthead. Is It's how people blew off steam before FPS were invented. How primitive. Yeah, it's pretty ghetto. Where'd you read about it? My grandpa was a fan. Wanna play? Just hit everything on the head and you win. Yes, 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 yes. Uh... Yeah? Use mouse. Yes, let's do it. Okay. Let's see. Oh god. Okay. My mouse just sometimes becomes a mouse, and then sometimes it like opens the menu at the top. <laughs> it's doing great. Time's up. Did I do well? Let's see how. 
Out of 46 total t uh, target appearances, you struck 77 times and made 42 successful hits. It's a 91% hit rate. That doesn't seem right. Uh, it's your new record. Okay. Um, I don't think that's 91% hit rate. I think that's like 50% if we're being honest. Okay. Another sparkly vendor. Some kids photos, I'm guessing. This is a class portrait. Oh, what if that's the picture she saw? Was that... Did she see like a picture on the bookshelf? I'm wondering if that's what it was. Mm-hmm. I can never understand you, Joey. How can you stand the taste of them? Are they just sour and, and icky? Oh. Sour and awesome is what you mean. Just try it. No, I don't even want to taste regular olives. You should at least try one, Johnny. Who knows, maybe you'll like it. Yeah. No. I'm done though. Can I go play? Uh, okay, but only the playground and not an inch too far. Just leave that that bag. I'll keep it for you. No, it's mine. I want it. Okay. Receive note: pickled olives. Is the pickled olives not the way out? I'm guessing not. I'm assuming this is the way to the playground. Oh. Interesting. Hello. Is he looking for someone? Oh, uh, way to follow mom's orders, huh? Where is he going? Oh! Whoa! Um... This cannot be safe. Whoa! Well, okay, so we wandered off the trail and found a cool place. But let's face it, he could have also been eaten by a pack of tigers. I guess don't travel in packs, idiot. It's just an expression. You know, when I was a kid, my grandpa took me stargazing every year. Yeah. There was a hill outside of the city and we, that we'd stay at the same one every year. We'd watch the stars till daybreak. Uh, well, I did, mostly. He just carried the telescope for me. Of course. The thing was, though, Ma didn't want me to stay up late. Grandpa always told her that we were just camping and hid the telescope inside the car. Uh, that's all good, but when we got back in the morning, I had to pretend like I actually slept. So in conclusion, that's the story of how I started my caffeine addiction. <laughs> You're terrible. I oh, know. It's a shame, though. All these nice memories lost and never found. And who knows how many more like it? Well, as you say, just take it moment for moment, right? Mm hmm. Oh, shit. 
I told you a pack of tigers dwell here. Oh my god, it's River! Hello? Okay. Wait, don't go! I'm Johnny, what's your name? Uh, you're at my spot. Your spot? Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to hog this place all to myself. Um, you wanna join me? Are you here to watch the stars? Are you? Oh my god, he met her before. I, I have a funny feeling I know what's in that bag. Guarantee it's a platypus, right? so cute just look at him did you know there were so many lights in the sky yes oh uh I did too you said this was your spot right only during the carnival not a fan of the crowds me neither. You know, you still haven't told me your name yet. I'm not telling you. Everyone makes fun of it in school. Why? They say it makes them want to go to the washroom. Oh, okay then. Well, uh, it can't be worse than John. I mean, everywhere in the world, nearly everyone's named John. Uh, even in India? Probably. What's wrong with that? Hmm. What's wrong with having a name that everyone has? Well, it's not boring, I guess. I mean, if everyone has it, then what's the point? I wouldn't mind. Just for once, to have the same name as everyone else? It's like there's lights in the sky. They all look the same from here, but that doesn't make them less any less pretty. Uh, I suppose. What do you think those stars up there are, anyway? My dad says they're giant burning spheres of gas. Okay, Lion King reference. Nice. Oh, I bet he's just making it up. Uh, why would he lie to me? Yeah, you know, that's what grown-ups do. They make things up. Santa, Easter Bunny, kangaroos, stuff like that. Have you ever made an Easter Bunny out of stars? Like a constellation? Yes. Um, of other things, never tried a rabbit, though. Do you want to make one? Yeah, we'll make the bestest constellation ever. Let's see who makes our oh, one out first. Okay, we'll start in three. Three, two, one, and I see it. Uh, where? In the sky. Well, where in the sky? Think big. Uh, bigger than the others. I don't know. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I see it. Tell me what you see. There. Right there. Two ears and a head. What else? And that there's, there's its two feet. 
Guess what else? And the moon. The moon is a big round belly. Well, that's cute. Yep, that's cute. So, what do you think they really are? The stars, I mean. I... I've never taught anyone, but... I've always thought there were lighthouses. Billions of lighthouses stuck at the far ends of the sky. Well, it must be so lively up there. But it isn't. They can see all the other lighthouses out there, and they want to talk to them. But they can't because they're all too far apart to hear what the others are saying. All they can do is shine their lights from afar. So that's what they do. Well, that's sad. Shine their lights at the other lighthouses and at me. Why are you? Because one day, I'm going to befriend one of them. The bag, what's in it? Oh, it's the prize I won from Whack-A-Mole. Did you get to play that game? I tried, but I'm too clumsy. What did you get from it? I got a thing. I didn't really know what it is. There it is! I knew it. Some kind of weird duck beaver thing? May I see it? It looks so strange. I wish I could win one myself. Johnny! Uh, that's my calling. Here. You know what? Keep it. It's yours. Mine? Yeah, I can always get another. I don't like to brag, but I'm totally the best at that game. Will you be here next year? Yep, will you? Yes. Same place, same time? Yes. What if you forget or get lost? Then we can always regroup on the moon, silly. Right on the rabbit's tummy. That's why the rabbit was blue and yellow. The yellow tummy for the for the moon. Oh! Johnny, coming! Oh yeah, I forgot my hacky sack in the bag. You said you're clumsy, right? Maybe it'll help. Oh my god. He doesn't remember this. Is that why she was so, so upset with him? If they ever get lost? Wait, what does that mean? Don't tell me you didn't see that coming. And here I thought this was going to be an inspirational childhood dream story. Should have known that some girl would come along and turn it into a cheese fest. I suppose now we know what we must do to send him to the moon. Wait, you aren't actually going to do it, are you? Bad job, Neil. It's what we are contracted to do. Damn, if we wait. Wait, no, what? Eva? Wait, but like, he wanted to go to the moon to meet up with her again, right? That's why he wants to go to the moon? I know you were in here. Okay.
Doing this for a year, you artificially generated bastard. This is all your fault. Stuff toy platypus. <laughs> Isn't he going to the moon to see her again? Oh, there she is. Turn around. Neil? I know what you're planning to do. I know that you know. Yeah? Well, I know that you know that I know. Look, our contract is to send him to the moon. And the only way for that to happen is if Johnny is motivated to do so. But if that means removing River, then what's the point? The reason he even wants to go to the moon in the first place is because she died. I know, but we are legally bound to the contract to specifically... Fuck the contract! I didn't take this job to make him miserable, Ava. I don't know about you, but I signed up to help the freaking geezer die happy. Me too, and I like this job. But if we directly go against our legal obligations, we'd be in for a court hearing. We'll appeal. We know that Johnny'd be happier to not go to the moon. Johnny would be happy with a lot of alternative life tangents, Neil. We're not here to play God. Our job is to give him what he signed for. Well, we happen to know what he wants better than that, does uh, than he does. Look, I'm only risking losing River because I believe in her, and... What do you mean, risk? You're removing her. And besides, I will make up for it. Make up for it how? We're running out of time. Just trust me. Since the one pushing me off the fucking lighthouse... Oh god. Whoa. Things change. Did you just... Freaking light data. Abusing your powers doesn't disable my controls entirely, Eva. Booby traps, really, Eva? Just trying to buy some time. Uh, gee, thanks for telling me. Oh. Well. God damn it. Those are some expensive pieces of equipment you're tossing. Seriously, just stay put and wait until I'm done. Oh, piss off. What? Look, don't make me exit this whole thing and unplug you. Do you really risk distorting his memories as they are? Just stop trying, please. This won't take long. Ah, uh, not again. Oh, come find me at the end of the hall. Why do I not trust you now? Okay, not there. Whoa. Are you gonna be freaking kidding? Is that- uh, is this a joke to you, Eva? Dear lord, they aren't just zombie Evas. There's zombievas. Don't come any closer. I got plants. Okay. Okay. Ooh, these things are good for something after all. Oh god. My guy. Alright. This whole thing is just a loop. Is there any way to break it? Oh, whoa. What? What the? What happened? Okay, no more plants in here. Oh, God. Ava, what's happened? Ava? God. Just tell me what it is. What is the 
they were lighthouses. Now the whole construct is messed up. What else? Bones of lighthouses stuck in the far ends of the sky? Rabbit. It's finished, River. She won't be alone anymore. I just, I just don't want to be another typical kid in a sea of people, Nick. What's it like? Just your responsibilities, I suppose. Okay. The pickles. Uh, I hope you understand her condition. I'd rather not. Why is that? I'm curious what she's doing. Whoa, horses. Okay. She's playing the piano, they're dancing. How much is he erasing? Hello? Wait, don't go. I'm Johnny. What's your name? What? Oh, in here? Look, it was a long time ago. There's no date or time, Johnny. What? I'm so confused. Are we going to see stuff change or... Phone call? Hello, Neil. Morpheus? <laughs> what? Xavier, you idiot. No shit, we're the only ones here. Listen, whatever you've been doing, stop it. We might not know what Johnny wants, but we know he doesn't. what he doesn't want. What he doesn't want is exactly what you are accelerating. It's already done, Neil. Why don't you come out now? What did she do? Okay, well, we're going to find out what's going on in the next episode because I feel like this is about to wrap up. So, um, yeah, for now, <laughs> uh, if you enjoyed this, please subscribe and join the Embarrassments, which is what I call my community. And I hope you're having a great day wherever you're at in your day. And I will see you next video. Bye.